Once there was a young boy born in Russia whose parents immigrated to the United States of America when they saw all of the pogroms springing up. This young man turned into being a songwriter and one day he met George Gershwin. Gershwin said, why don't you come work with me? But the young man turned him down. His name was Shalom Secunda, a person of whom I'm sure you have not heard. Shalom Secunda is known for having written one song. It's called By Mir Bistushain. Shortly after he wrote it, he sold it to a publisher for guess how much money? $15. After he sold the song, Guy Lombardo played it on the radio, the Andrew sisters recorded it, and it became the most sung, most whistled, most hummed song in the United States of America. Every time a single of by Mir Mr. Shane was published by a record company, just coincidentally, it would have a Gershwin song on the B side. Shalom Secunda always thought Gershwin would have found that very funny. Please welcome the ever versatile Rachel Kaplan. Of all the boys I've known, and I've known some, until I first met you, I was lonesome. And then you came in sight, dear, my heart grew light, and this whole world seemed new to me. You're really swell, I have to admit you deserve expressions that really fit you. And so I've racked my brain hoping to explain all the things that you do to me. But mere Mr. Shane, please let me explain. But mere Mr. Shane means you're grand. But mere Mr. Shane, again I'll explain. It means you're the fairest in the land. I could say Bella, Bella, even say Wunderbar. Each language only helps me tell you how. Mr. Shane, again I'll explain, but mere Mr. Shane means you're grand. But mere Mr. Shane, you've heard it all before, but let me try to explain. 